How could one man, Adolf Hitler, reshape the course of world history with such profound and devastating consequences? This question often baffles historians and researchers alike. Adolf Hitler, a name synonymous with destruction and despair, paradoxically, played a pivotal role in shaping the 20th century world order. Understanding this man's life and actions is not just a historical pursuit, but a necessity to prevent the recurrence of such atrocities. To comprehend his influence we must delve into his life, starting from his birth in 1889. Born in Braunau am Inn, Austria, Hitler's early life was not extraordinary. Adolf Hitler, the fourth of six children, was born to Alois Hitler and Clara Poltzel. His father, a stern, hard-working man, wanted young Adolf to follow in his footsteps as a civil servant. However, Hitler was a dreamer, his heart set on a career in fine arts, much to his father's disapproval. His childhood was turbulent, marred by frequent disagreements with his father. It was during these formative years that he developed a strong nationalism, fueled by the German nationalist history he studied in school. This, coupled with his deep love for opera, particularly Richard Wagner's work, profoundly influenced his ideologies. Despite his early academic failures, Hitler aspired to become an artist, a dream that took him to Vienna. Here he experienced poverty and became exposed to various political ideologies, which would later shape his political career. Soon, Hitler's life would take a dramatic turn as he served in World War I. World War I profoundly shaped Hitler, propelling him into the world of politics. A decorated soldier in the trenches, Hitler was deeply affected by Germany's defeat. As he returned to a country in turmoil, his disillusionment turned into a burning ambition to restore national pride. Hitler's political journey began with his involvement in the German Workers' Party, a small political group. His fiery speeches and charismatic presence quickly gained him popularity, eventually leading to his appointment as the party's leader. Under his leadership the party was rebranded as the National Socialist German Workers' Party, or more commonly known as the Nazi Party. Hitler's rhetoric resonated with many Germans, who were grappling with the harsh realities of the Treaty of Versailles and the Great Depression. His promise of a strong, prosperous Germany fueled his rise to power, leading to an unprecedented political ascent. Hitler's political ascent was swift. In 1933 he was appointed Chancellor of Germany. As Chancellor, Hitler rapidly consolidated power. He used the Reichstag fire in February of 1933 as a pretext to push through the Enabling Act, which effectively allowed him to legislate without the involvement of the Reichstag. This move dismantled the democratic structures of the Weimar Republic and marked the beginning of the totalitarian Nazi state. Hitler's dictatorship was marked by the implementation of aggressive policies and an expansionist ideology. His government controlled every aspect of life, suppressing civil liberties and promoting an Aryan supremacist agenda. Anti-Semitic legislation like the Nuremberg Laws systematically marginalized Jews and other minorities, setting the stage for the Holocaust. In foreign policy, Hitler defied the Treaty of Versailles by rearming Germany and reclaiming lost territories. His annexation of Austria and the Sudetenland region of Czechoslovakia in 1938 brought Europe to the brink of war. Hitler's aggressive policies and expansionist ideology led the world into World War II. World War II, initiated by Hitler, reshaped the world. Hitler's aggressive foreign policies and expansionist ideology set the stage for the war. His violation of the Treaty of Versailles by reclaiming the Rhineland and annexing Austria and the Sudetenland were key actions leading to the outbreak of the war in September of 1939. Hitler's strategies during the war were marked by initial fast-paced successes, using blitzkrieg tactics to swiftly conquer much of Europe. However, his invasion of the Soviet Union marked a turning point, with the brutal Eastern Front draining German resources and morale. Parallel to the war, Hitler and the Nazi regime orchestrated one of the most horrific genocides in history, the Holocaust. This systematic state-sponsored murder resulted in the death of six million Jews, along with millions of other victims deemed undesirable by the Nazi regime. Hitler's anti-Semitic policies were driven by a perverted ideology of racial purity, blaming Jews for Germany's problems and portraying them as a threat to the Aryan race. The Holocaust's atrocities, kept secret during the war, were revealed to a horrified global community as Allied forces liberated concentration and extermination camps. The magnitude of the genocide was a shocking testament to the depths of Nazi depravity. The war's end marked the beginning of Hitler's downfall, 
but the shadow of his actions, the war and the Holocaust, forever darkened the pages of human history. The final years of Hitler's life were marked by defeat and despair. As the tide of World War II turned against Germany, Hitler's once indomitable spirit began to crumble. His health deteriorated, and his decisions became increasingly erratic. By early 1945 as Allied forces closed in, Hitler retreated to his bunker in Berlin, a grim fortress of solitude from where he would direct his final days. In this bunker, faced with the impending fall of the Third Reich, Hitler made the decision to end his own life. On April 30, 1945, he and his longtime companion Eva Braun, whom he had married just a day before, died by suicide. Their bodies were burnt, leaving behind only a charred testament to a life that had altered the course of history. In the aftermath of Hitler's death and the fall of Nazi Germany, the Nuremberg trials were held. These were a series of military tribunals, convened to bring Nazi war criminals to justice. High-ranking officials were tried for crimes against humanity, war crimes, and genocide. The trials marked a significant step towards establishing a global standard for human rights and justice. As we reflect on the long-term impact of Adolf Hitler and his regime, we are confronted with a legacy that is as complex as it is chilling. Hitler's policies transformed Germany into an economic powerhouse, but at a devastating cost. His aggressive expansionism and ideology of Aryan supremacy led to World War II and the genocide of six million Jews during the Holocaust. The consequences of Hitler's rule continue to reverberate through history. His reign serves as a stark reminder of the destructive power of totalitarianism, racial hatred and war. It underscores the importance of democratic values, human rights and peace. Adolf Hitler's legacy is a stark reminder of the devastating potential of unchecked power and hate.